Darren, good afternoon. Nice to meet you. What How are you, you doing? Giving a blood donation. OK, and why is that? Well, it will ultimately help me to live longer um, and healthier. There was a study recently which showed that if uh, you give twice a year only, uh, you have a 20% less chance of getting cancer. OK. Um, also, that w as you grow old, you kind of build up a lot of bad things in your blood. So you're trying so. to get rid of all the bad stuff I, that's in your blood? I want to, yes. Well, you're giving it to other people who need the blood. <laughs> So they, it's a they, bit dubious. They need it. They need it. <laughs> How old are you? I'm 52. 52? Yeah. But bio biologically, you must be younger. You look younger. Yeah, it depends which metric you look at. Um, I've had some blood work done, and it shows me as 40. Uh -huh. um, and I had some DNA methylation. It's kind of a new thing to look at uh, your DNA and, and all the, uh, let's say, the commented code that's on top yeah. of it. And it showed me around 46, and then 48, and then 52. So it Which varies. Good, yeah, yeah, still. And what's the purpose? Do you want to become like me at least 100 or even 120? Certainly. <laughs> Certainly. There we go. <laughs> yeah. No, dying has no interest for me. Exactly. So. I think dead is really boring. Dead is very boring. <laughs> it's true. I mean, growing old is OK, but it, the, the diseases that come with it and the you know, incapacity and the, yeah. the feebleness. And mm -hmm. it's just, to me, it's a tragedy. Yeah. Oké, okay, bloedgeven is heel veilig. Maar bij Darren thuis praten we verder bij zijn indrukwekkende verzameling pillen. Met onschuldige en minder onschuldige preparaten. So, these are the substances I take based on my plan. Okay. And for each of the problems, I've got a therapy. Okay. Uh, this one here, this is C60 in olive oil, and it increased the lifespan of rats by 90%. There's no official studies on humans yet. This is uh, new. Rapamycin, that increases the lifespan of mice up to 50%. Melatonin for a Melatonin, moment yeah. as well. This is actually, it was 18% that rodents, I don't know if it was mice or rats, but yeah. improved their lifespan. This one here, it's called Acarbose. It's a diabetic type thing which lowers your glucose, but it was shown to increase by 20% lifespan. Okay. And there's some more stuff in the fridge. Yeah. Yeah, I can show you the Foxo4 if yes. you want. Yeah. Foxo4 Dry is een middel dat heel recent door een Nederlandse wetenschapper, Peter de Keizer, werd ontwikkeld. Net als professor Maier wil hij daarmee een oplossing bieden voor het opruimen van die zombiecellen. Zo liet professor de Keizer een proefmuis 130 jaar oud worden, in mensenjaren geteld dan. Als je het op papier leest, klinkt het bijna science fiction. We, kan, we kunnen het verouderingsproces terugdraaien, maar het is gewoon feit. Althans, bij een muis ja. is het feit. Ja, op deze drie dingen, daar wil ik wel bij zeggen. Dus we moeten het ook niet groter maken dan het is, maar inderdaad op haargroei, fitheid en nierfunctie kunnen we zeker dat herstellen. Ja. Darren's vrouw komt er in de keuken even bij zitten, want zij is niet zo gerust in die Foxo 4 Dry. We have to keep the Foxo 4 dry in the fridge. It's kind of delicate. Cute little bottle. Yeah. Uh -huh. So that's an injection. This is uh, an injection. Okay. Fortunately, it doesn't work orally at all. Mm -hmm. So you have to get used to stabbing yourself. Okay. Now, with this stuff, you don't have to take it very often. Um, in fact, you might just take it once per year, depending on your age. Okay. So that's a small injection, but how much is the bottle costing? I have no idea. Yeah, this is expensive. This is something around, uh, well, it's come down a lot recently, but this may be around 200 bucks or something. Mm. Used to be a few thousand, right? Yeah, yeah, used to be. One shot. But now it's $200. And you only do it like a couple yeah. of times a year. Yeah. But yeah, so. like set of 10 or 20, right? Yeah, Each so you do for a month. Like 10 injections or 20 oh, yeah. injections, yeah. so it's not like just one shot. Yeah. So okay. when you adapt, especially, you know. This might be dangerous there... and don't take uh, too much of it. And yeah, stuff. no, that's true. I'm concerned about him. Here, when you do on your own at home, it's but dangerous. It's a small injection, though. I mean... But it's, it's very like... powerful. I think this should be more control, double blind study. Well, what I was going to say is, is you're absolutely, I think you're absolutely right. It's just to wait for human trials is seriously at least 10 years off. But have the doctor involved in that, not 
doing on your own and just using Google or whatever, because many info which is on the internet, as we know, <laughs> it's fake. And many people, mamas and papas, writing some stuff because mm. they think it's magic herb or magic something. It has to be more, yeah. you know, scientific approach. And there's never a day that you are like a little bit worried, am I doing the right thing? Uh, well, I'm constantly concerned about it. But there's no doctor saying this is dangerous. Well, I'm sure if I talked to a lot of doctors, I'd get a lot of doctors saying, please stop, yes. Really? <laughs> and you know that, and you still go ahead with it? Yeah, well, you know, I, I'm doing this not only for myself, but, you know, I'm publishing mm -hmm. the information on my okay. website. And uh, so people will be informed by my results, whether they're good, bad, or, or I die tomorrow. And uh, that's helpful. Good. And you just inject it into your stomach, or? Yes. Uh, okay. So I have to uh, disinfect the spot. Do you need help? No, well, thank you. Just any random place where there's fat. Okay. Lots to choose from. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Hop. Goes fast. Yeah. But have you seen some results with the fuck so far? Yeah, it's it's difficult to to gauge because you know I was also starting to I've had great results, but mm -hmm. I've I've also started to exercise more, and you know how it works when you start to look at something more carefully, it affects it affects mm -hmm. it. So that's why they have placebo trials, and even placebos people yeah. people get I mean, big positive results with placebos. Yeah. So um, you know unless it's with rats, I, I, it's hard to control. But have you seen the results, I, my, or my, you just feel better? Yeah, no, my results are great. My blood work has improved a lot. Mm -hmm. Of course, my um, I used to have this metabolic syndrome. My blood sugar is great. My cholesterol is good. All of my markers are really good now. I'm very happy with my new regimen. Good. Well, good luck with it. Thank you. Ik vind het toch een beetje tegenstrijdig eigenlijk, want je zoekt de eeuwige jeugd en je neemt levensgevaarlijke medicatie. Waar je desgevallend dus dood van kan gaan. Ik snap het niet. Het gaat me te ver. Als ik me 